guys, I'm Palak and welcome back to my channel. So as promised, I'm back with yet another video on my YouTube channel and this is a get ready with me tag. So uh, I have shot this video back in India but then I did not quite get a lot of time to compile it. So here I am presenting this video to you guys now. So um, this look is very very ideal for all those ladies who want to go out for casual office parties, for get togethers and even all those young women who are getting ready for farewell party. It is a very simple look and uh, I wanted to make it very very minimal and not over the top. So it is for all you ladies who want to keep it very simple and uh, not go very jhatang with your look so yes let me know what you feel about this in the comment section below and don't forget to watch this video till the end because I'm completely in love with this look and I was super happy with this and I achieved this in just 20 minutes you guys so yes if you are getting late then this look is just for you before jumping right into the video I would like you guys to follow me on Instagram as well the username will be somewhere on the screen uh, because obviously I post a lot of updates on Instagram and if you want to be updated of what is happening in my life that is the best platform I guess so uh, yes uh, let's just stay connected and jump right into the video to start with I have chosen this beautiful pink sari with a thin golden border and a floral printed blouse. I have got this blouse stitched. It is a boat neck pattern at the front and an open neck design with a bow at the back. This sari is very light on the body and is just so perfect for ladies who face problem walking in heavy saris. This is how I look after draping the sari. So just a few tips while you drape a sari. Since it is a falling pallu, make sure you pin it at the back of your blouse and not at the shoulder. Before making the patli, just secure the sari with a pin to give it a good shape near your waist. Now like a normal sari, make your patli and put the entire bundle into the petticoat. Take them together and secure it with a sari pin. So let me tell you guys I always follow these tips while draping a sari because I myself am not very good at wearing saris but with these tips I am all sorted. For my makeup look I will first start with my Lakme CC cream. Uh, make sure your face is moisturized and take some cream over your hand and start applying it on your face and blend it evenly. Since this is a very minimal and light makeup look, I won't be using any foundation here because I like to keep it very simple when it comes to makeup. So yes, once I am done uh, blending in the entire Lakme CC cream on my face evenly, uh, I'll uh, just do my eyes a little bit. I will take the Lakme Iconic Kajal and apply it over my eyes in the form of an eyeliner. Once I'm happy with that, I will fill in my brows with the help of a brown eyeshadow that I have. Once I am done with that, I will apply some compact on my face and finish up my eye look with the help of mascara. Now I will apply a little blush on my cheekbones. I like to keep it a little subtle so I won't apply a lot but very light. To finish up my makeup look I will apply this pink colored lipstick which just matches the color of my sari and I really like how it uh, entirely complements my makeup look and yes uh, after that I will just take a pair of earrings. I got these uh, earrings from Mintra. I absolutely love these earrings for its unique design. And yay, I am all ready for the party in no time.
guys i hope you like this video i got uh, this look in just 20 minutes 10 minutes to drape my sari and 10 minutes for the makeup look so if you are looking out for a minimum minimal makeup and uh, a very elegant sari look then just try this and i'm sure you won't be disappointed for more such videos just keep watching my channel and uh, yes don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you soon with yet another video till then stay happy bye bye